Necron grows ever stronger. Are we truly our creator's best option? It matters not. Our time of need approaches. Let the power of the Allspark guide us to our hallowed path. As our world heals, he shall die. None can stop us. Onward to the long march of infinity. between our worlds was unimaginable, interstellar light years apart. But time and again, it seemed Cybertron was destined to intertwine with Earth, with Unicron. His awakening has sent the planet into chaos. Decepticons, once hidden for cycles, now emerge. <laughs> to escape the end of days. Keep moving, humans! You're not safe here! I'm tired, man! Run, just run, 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 run! run. Come on, keep moving! Hudson, we're just jumping! God 
shit, camera. No, I'm not dropping the camera. We're gonna document this shit. Oh, come on, huh? man. Wait, those cars. We, we can get in those cars. And Decepticons. Oh, my God. They're free. Hey, Vortex. If you like killing something quick, oh, I'm all for it. What are you doing? Now, Volocks! Autobot down! <laughs> Finally, something good comes out of today. Who needs Megatron? We got this all on our. What the? Is that a sword? You rang? Best get out of here, human. This ain't no place for you. Quintessa's staff has been used to stabilize Cybertron while bringing no continued harm to Earth. It is unknown to us how many have fallen, but each day the list of casualties climbs. Over a million lives taken. And that was only today's report. Ooh, Chihuahua! Squeaks? Chihuahua fits? No, 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 I, I'm fine. But you could set up a sick bay for the remaining bots. Sick bay. What do you need, Bumblebee? I still haven't gotten word from Sam. Keep trying. I have. For days, Optimus. Then I would recommend filtering through the list of those who were lost. But see, that's what I've been dreading. If I see his name on there, I'll... I don't know. Regardless, Megatron will be destroyed when next we meet. Optimus, that... Never mind. Whoa, take it easy. Prime's rage. I've seen it before. And that look. He's not the Optimus we once knew and loved. Then we find Megatron and kill him. It's a win-win. Is it though? Without Megatron, who would Prime's anger target next? Come on, I'm sure he's not that far gone. You've only just come back to us, Hot Rod. Ever since Chicago, he's been different. Anyway. What are you doing now? I'm looking for someone. Okay, come on, Sam. Don't be here. Don't be here, buddy. Come on. Don't be here. No, no. It's not. It's not. It's not you, buddy. It's not. It's not. Oh, God, Sam, no! Please tell me this is wrong! No, oh, Sam, you can't be gone, too! Please, not you! Bumblebee? Oh, he's gone! Ugh. I am sorry. I shouldn't have left him, Optimus! You made me do this! We did what was necessary. I don't want to hear it, Optimus! I'm done! Where are you going? For a drive! B, wait! Wait!
that time is now. Shouldn't take much longer. I'm surprised you didn't run like the coward you are. Took me ages to dig you up, let alone your arm. It's quiet. Well, yeah, the fighting is over. No, her voice. It's gone. But you still have her mark. Indeed. Done. I think. It'll do. What happens now? What is that? I don't know, but I've seen a lot of them. In fact, the humans have reported a growing number of these things. I should have checked in, answered your calls, but... You will always be my friend, Sam. I never had the opportunity to meet him. But Optimus spoke fondly of your history. He meant a lot to you, huh? You know, the, the worst thing is... This is just something else on the list to process. I may miss you. Get it out. You'll always be my first car. Love you, B. I think I understand Prime now. Ah, oui. So do I. But what matters most is deciding how we react to these moments. Uh, it's a little funny hearing you get sentimental in that accent. I'm telling you, half a century in Europe will do that to you. But, c'est la vie. Ah, <sighs> by 
by the all spark. This sucks. And honestly, it's been so hard dealing with everything without you to vent to. Ah, we oui, the good old days. World War II was the good old days? Uh, take it back. Uh. You'll be remembered. We'll have a ceremony. Prime, we got another report of them insect things. That makes over 1,000 reports. Also, it's been cycles, and I haven't heard anything from the yellow bugger. We have no time to grieve. That's a little dismissive, don't you think? Keep scanning for Megatron. What do you think I've been doing all this time? Speed up your efforts. You know what? You've been a real foul git lately. I get it. It's a lot of pressure. We're building Cybertron, but you're really letting it screw with you. You're out of line, Crosshairs. I'm the only one willing to speak the truth. Ask the others. You'll see. Green, big, big chihuahua. I have no patience for this. Oh, that felt good. You could have been less aggressive about it. Oh, please. Even you can see Prime's changed. Look at all he's been through. Every mentor he's had stabbed him in the back. And that's not even including the humans. <sighs> the last time you saw Cybertron? Decades ago. I miss it, but I got comfortable here. Yeah, I get that. I just can't shake the feeling that Unicron is right below us. And the rumblings. Big boy is waking up. It's so freaky. Don't mean to cut you off, monsieur, but there's a Decepticon en route. You know what? Good. It'll keep my mind off things. Freeze! Put your hands where I can see them. I swear, every time I think you're dead, you always come back. You... You can talk? Yeah, I know. Surprised me too. Then allow me to crush your throat once more. It's two against one, and from what Beers told me, you're quite the coward. You were saying... Radio Optimus. Get him, Megatron! What are you doing? Shoot them! No running this time. Let's do this, Monomy. No. No, this one's mine. More than you barricade! I'm taking out a lot of repressed anger here. Yeah, yeah, right in his ugly face. Yeah. 
You got this, B. Keep it up. Will you shut up? That was gonna happen, didn't you? I am not here to harm you. Good. It'll make it easier for us. You would be an ignorant fool to dismiss my help. You do wish to defeat Unicron, yes? What do you mean by that? I know more than I should. Enough to savor this world. So you mean to tell me you want to help us? Indeed. To what end? After this is over, Megatron, who's to say you won't stab us in the back? You shall never have a reason to trust my word. At least you know you're an asshole. In any case, why? The lies we have been fed, the number of worlds torn apart, and the countless battles were never worth a cycle of leadership. My death has put matters into perspective. Deaths. Excuse me? Are we talking about your Mission City death or Chicago? I really wish you Autobots would change. <laughs> well, look who's talking, Megatron, Galvatron, Megatron. Under Quintessa's control, her voice echoing in my head, I now know the true meaning of oppression. Yeah, yeah, you got tired of being a puppet. Well, that's all you've ever been, hasn't it? Whether it's the Fallen, Sentinel, Quintessa, you've always been someone's tool. I know. Believe me, I do. Out of the way, Hot Rod! No! He wants to help us! Do not be blinded by his lies! He is to do nothing but pay for his actions! Here and now I am reminded of the time I first found you. A slave to your own fear, yet filled with immense passion. And you have filled my head with lies! For stellar cycles we worked as one! You know me better than the rest. And so you grew wise to my deceptions. In the end, the only words of mine you could trust were the truth. Just, just listen to what he has to say, Optimus. Please. Ugh. Do you expect me to believe you will place the future of this planet before your own twisted will? If you wish to destroy Unicron without bringing harm to this planet, I will assist you. When have you ever done something that wasn't in your interest, but solely for the benefit of another? The day I found you! I wanted to drive my blade through your spark 
and end the last remains of the dynasty. Instead, I let you live, and I brought you up as a warrior, because you are a prime, and I knew our planet needed you. In war, nothing is more painful than watching the death toll rise endlessly. Our war has done no less to this planet. We were brothers once. Quintessa is the great deceiver. She whispered lies into our minds, poisoned the past, and bent the galaxy to her will. Quintessa has clearly taken advantage of our conflict. She is not our creator. So, if her plan was to fool us into thinking she created us, what was her end goal? It is without any doubt she would brand herself the savior of Cybertron and use it towards her political advantage. So what about Big Spiky Boy at center of Earth? Her staff of power is a relic powerful enough to extinguish Unicron's spark. Its power would destroy the Earth. And that is a cost too grand. There must be another way. While the weight of your words speak the truth, history has taught me countless times to never trust you. Failure is an old friend, something I crave to be separated from. All I ever wanted was to be back in charge, without a means of war. We were indeed brothers once. Bumblebee, give me an update. Bumblebee? Uh, they're still talking. Oh, of course. Let them keep talking at their leisure. It's not like the world's on its way out. Oh, wait a minute. Knock it off, dude. Now, what do you want? I wish to speak with the Prime. Oh, of course! More talking! Why not? There is much he does not understand. Ugh, I'll ping his location for you, but make it quick. This knowledge spans to an era before time. I will... try. Ah, this is so weird. It's been almost an hour. I know. It's like I'm just waiting for Megatron to make a move, but... He seems... I don't know... Vulnerable. I... I... I don't like this. I mean, I know Prime needs it, but... Gotta be honest. If Megatron did to me what he has to you, I'd take this chance to snuff him. Uh, the thought had crossed my mind. And seeing Sam on that list? I'm not even going to think about that. This is no longer about the survival of our species, Optimus. There are mysteries to the universe beyond our comprehension. I have never felt so insignificant. The universe is vast, unending. And no matter how unfathomable accomplishments, it barely makes a difference. Forgive you. 
There is no need. used to be like. Before the war, I mean. Young, naive, but unimaginably wise. You saw the best in everyone. But above all, you were strong enough to be gentle. I always hope to recover those parts of me. I am the one who took them from you. I would agree, but your death brought me no peace. Hey, uh, Prime? What do you need? Sorry, I, I, I don't mean to interrupt, but the knights are here, and they want to talk. Finally. They've been awfully quiet since the battle. Optimus Prime. I stand before you with cordial intent. I do hope you can forgive our impetuous actions against you. All is in the past now. We feel that it's best for you all to finally know the truth about where you came from. We hope the knowledge may grant you peace of mind, and perhaps assist in gathering a solution. Okay, then can you just make it make sense? Because our entire history feels like just a big mess. It is a history long forgotten. The Allspark truly was your life giver. Its origins a complete mystery to you all. My greatest assumptions have led to the possibility of the cube being forged by our creators. You would be correct. Our creators, the Quintessons, were a race far superior than anything across the universe. But their rule was challenged with the emergence of Unicron. We know not where we came from, only that he held the power to destroy all existence of life. The Quintessons cyberformed worlds to make us. Oh, mon dieu, he talks. The old spark was built by the elemental metals gathered. A vessel of creation, and with it, our home was born. An early Cybertron of sorts. But to us, we called it Primus. Stepping foot on Primus, the original thirteen were made. We Twelve Knights and Quintessa. Unicron would soon fall by our efforts, cast out to the stars. And so with time and gravitational force, it would make sense for the Earth to form around this slumbering titan. Our creators would visit Earth years after to construct more armies to defend the Allspark. But now, it seems Unicron is awakening due to Quintessa's return. So why is she a problem too then? She was born alongside you all, so what could she have done? With force, she manipulated Inverticus to her side and did the unthinkable. Your master is no more. You have failed him. Infernicus, do you seek redemption? My master, I do. She killed her creators. But why would she do that? We view the Quintessons as gods, and she was the answer to the question. Can an all-powerful god 
create something stronger than itself. We rebelled against her. The battle was met with the destruction of Primus. We robbed her of the staff and used it to lock her into stasis. But it wouldn't last long. Before our departure, I had the old spark jettison into space. <laughs> now that seems to be a reoccurring theme. The cube crashed into a barren world, forming your Cybertron. And that is where our history began. The Seven Primes would emerge, having little to no knowledge of the wars prior. We ran to Earth to protect the staff and guard Unicron's remains. It all makes sense. We had fallen for her lies. As did I. Even Lockdown. He told a similar story. Only fabricated. Lockdown had no interest other than material gain. He would have been easy to fool. After the events of Chicago, Quintessa must have found the half of Cybertron which did not make it through. Okay, but Unicron... How were you able to cast him out? There was but a single object he feared. The Allspark. Its power forced him into stasis. I wish I didn't have to tell you this, but the Allspark was lost. No, Optimus. You've carried it within you for cycles. The Matrix? But how? Sam. Sam? What about him? He had the Allspark's knowledge stuck in his mind. Kind of weird, but I guess it transferred into the Matrix? The cube was merely a vessel. Its power and its knowledge can never be destroyed. It can only transform. Your old Spark Matrix is the key to Earth's survival. All this time, you had the Allspark. If that is the case, we are to unite this relic with the very spark of Unicron. Ah, really? Well, I agree that makes sense. How do we expect to, you know, get inside him? Sentinel Prime's pillars. I thought only Sentinel could control them. Controlling an entire system of pillars remotely required Sentinel. However, a single pillar could be used by an individual. So, a portable teleportation device? I'd like one of those. Such little time remains. He will soon awaken and destroy this world. Should we get the others? I do not wish to concern them. Cybertron relies on their overwatch. Bumblebee, Hot Rod, I'm putting you in charge of gathering the pillars. Megatron and I will construct our plan of action. Honor to the end. Yes, they're everywhere. Let's give him a hand. The cavalry's here, boy! Tally ho!
Ah, excellent work, gentlemen. Thank you, Cogman. Oh, so you remember me then? I suppose I do. Then that is progress, my friend. Very good. <laughs> Try, Icarus, stand guard. Our watch continues. <laughs> Cogman, you look... taller. I feel taller. Found this old body just laying about. Mm -hmm. Now, what can I help you find, gentlemen, with? Perhaps an end-of-the-world cup of oil? Uh-huh. Listen, all we need is... Why not a doomsday champagne of Energon? No. We just... And for you, perhaps a nice waxing to look all spick and span. Actually, that sounds good. Enough! Listen, Cogman, we're just here for the pillars. Hmm, <clears throat> um, which ones? The Space Bridge Pillars. For what? Well, we think we know how to stop Unicron, but to do that, we need to get inside of him. <laughs> God, well, I'd call you all crazy, but we're on our way out, so crazy might just do. Circle back for a moment. Are the parasites a global issue? Ah yes, little sods are everywhere. One bite and you explode merely a cycle later. Literally boils your energon. Awful way to go, very messy. Ugh, it's a oh, bloody and... Ugh. And they came from Unicron? Quite so. They're rust-eating parasites which feed off his body. Now that his horns have broken the surface, so have they. And I'm sure, comparatively, they're the least of our problems. Righty. I'll get those pillars for you now. Hold tight. Uh, and the waxing. P please. still do not trust me. This matrix, Allspark, since the beginning, it has been the driving cause for our war. I do not seek it, for it would turn to dust in my hands. The matrix must indeed be earned. I will never hold the matrix within my grasp. Whoa! My exiles are shaking! Optimus, we got him. Excellent work. Before we embark on this journey, may I have a word with you, B? Oh, uh, okay. Uh, Hot Rod, watch over Megatron. I'm watching you. Bumblebee, I do apologize for my dismissive actions. I am under a lot of stress. Trust me, Optimus. I, I, I do understand. Even Primes have a breaking point. And I unfortunately have arrived at mine. Deep down, I know there's the gentle Optimus I've always known, okay? No one will know the violence it took to become that gentle. But you know what? The old you is still very much alive. Like... I don't know. Like a... Like a smoldering ember that could start a forest fire. Thank you, Bumblebee. I needed to hear that. It is time. So what are we waiting for? I want to kick some godly ace. Autobots, Megatron, I believe we've learned more about ourselves today than we have over a lifetime of war. And while we may lose sight of the morals we hold dear, be kind, always be kind, for it is a strategic virtue. In the heart of darkness, we are a team, and a team to the end. Pinpoint your positions. Arm and lock. I 
activate. Whoa! What the fuck? This is unreal. These walls have existed long before the dawn of time. Can you really call them walls? Aren't they like goats? Do you think Unicron knows where the inside of him? I am sure he already does. You hear that? More parasites. Do not let them bite you. You saw what happened. Autobots, fight song. I want one of those. Prime! Are you even listening to me? What are you whining about now? Optimus' signal just vanished. So did B and Hot Rods. Maybe the scanner's busted. I don't know. The scanner is just fine. Whatever they're doing, it can't be that important. Disgusting! Putrid! Parasites! Nearing Unicron Spark Chamber. before it begins. You shall do no such thing. Ah! You have nothing left but your death. Ah. 
And what will you do now, wretch? It's okay. <laughs> I haven't laughed like that in a while. Where on Sabaton have you been? What's Megatron doing here? I need explanations. How much time you got? Has settled. It appears we were successful. This is all I have ever wanted, Megatron. I had asked for a truce cycles ago, and your response was to cut off my head. I accept my own faults. Despite our differences, we are also very much alike. We always have been. Cybertron needs the both of us. Together, we can repair our home and lead our people to a life of peace. Quintessa may still be out there. I endanger you all if I stay. I must go where I can never be found. If that is what you believe is right, is this your way of telling me you want me to leave? It is not. <laughs> that was a joke, Artemis. I didn't know you made those. Either way, best of luck. Farewell, brother. Farewell, brother. At a moment of our choosing, fate has called upon us and yielded its reward. Tranquility. An end to the war. Cybertron watches over Earth now, orbiting as a second moon, watching over us, 
over Unicron. I am Optimus Prime, and I send this message in an hour of unity and peace to humankind, to my brother. Our futures shall be faced together. For the day has come forth. The day all are 